how virtual pointer and virtual table actually works let's see that so if you see this this is the traditional example and we have stored two object one is base and one is derived into both base pointers and this is how roughly compiler will convert this call into this call so what we are doing is we have this vptr so this is the pointer and then we are dereferencing that pointer with the index saying that okay give me the address stored at that particular location so in that case this is that address which is going to get returned and if you will see the derived class i mean derived object is stored into base pointer in that case you will have dereferencing to this pointer derived and this vptr is belonging to the actual object which is derived so that's why vptr's zero location this time is coming as derived f not base f so this is how it looks like right thanks for watching i'll see you in the next videos bye bye take care